Revelation chapter 1 and verse 7. Behold, he cometh with clouds, and every eye shall see him, and they also which pierced him, and all kindreds of the earth shall wail because of him, even so a man. First and foremost, I'd like to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh Hashem Yahushai. I want to give double honor to the apostles of great millstone that do rule well. Salutation to the men of the hopeful and sincere elect. This is your brother Makaza from the Trinidad camp. Just want to do a little edification for the elect's sake. And the name of this lesson would be The Rapture Won't Be a Secret Event. The Rapture Won't Be a Secret Event. All right. And when you look up the word rapture, it basically just means rape, rape or taken by force. All right. But that is what they call the salvation of the elect. All right. So just like the Lord delivered Israel from Egypt and all people knew about it and they saw the, the salvation of the Lord, they're going to see the salvation of the Lord again in these last times. All right. You know, the scripture says that two shall be in a field and one taken, two women shall be going and one taken. All right. So these Christians, they think that, you know, that, you know, people going to just be going about their merry lives, normal day. And just whoa, we're just gonna have this event, this worldwide event that people just gonna start going missing, leaving the clothes behind, and people just disappear, and no one knows where they go. No, that's not how it's gonna happen. That's not how it's gonna happen. That's not scriptural. All right. First and foremost, prophecies will be taking place, and before the so-called rapture happens, all right, you will see. The MOTB being pushed, World War Three martial law. All right, you will see these events, and just be a matter of fact, during World War Three, when the missiles being shot, at that same hour, the Lord Yahweh Shai gonna come with the chariots of heaven, the, the what you call UFOs. At that said hour, the Lord gonna come to deliver the elect. All right. And all eyes are gonna see, just like they showed you in Independence Day, all eyes are gonna see the Lord coming with the chariots of heaven. All right. Enoch, the seventh from Adam, he said, Behold, the Lord cometh with ten thousands of his saints. And he just read it. He said, Behold, means look, look, the Lord coming with his chariots. All eyes are gonna see. That's why it said, The Lord alone shall be exalted in that day. All right, so the, 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 the so called rapture ain't gonna be no secret event, it's gonna be a, a, a great, a, a grand event where all eyes gonna see and behold the destruction of the wicked and the salvation of the righteous, which are of the house of Israel. All right, this is the book of Luke, chapter 3 and verse 4. It says, As it is written in the book. Of the words of Isaiah, the prophet, saying, The voice of one crying in the wilderness, Prepare ye the way of the Lord, make his path straight. Every valley shall be filled, and every mountain shall be brought low. And this is from the nuclear missiles. And the crooked shall be made straight, and the rough ways shall be made smooth. And all flesh shall, shall see the salvation of the Lord. All flesh. They're going to see it. All right? Ain't gonna have people just disappear now. You're gonna be like, Where John gone? Where's Mary? You know, where where these people gone? It's like it just then they're gonna have you know reports on CNN and NBC and then all over the radios and all over the internet and people just talking about you know they just seen clothes just and, and planes crashing because the pilot disappeared and, and this bus driver disappeared and, and nobody knows and I was just walking with my wife or just walking with my husband and she just disappeared just and just left clothes now. No, that's not what's gonna happen. That's what they want you to believe. Because when the Lord comes with the chariots, they don't want you to acknowledge the fact that that is the Lord coming. But guess what? You will. You will. As the scriptures say, every tongue shall confess. All right? You will know that is the Lord. Yahaba Hashem Yahushai. So-called white man and these Christian pastors, they just working hand in hand to, to deceive you. All right? The rapture won't be no secret event. All eyes will see when the elect being taken up. All right, just like they show you the movies when you when you so called UFOs they send down their beams and they take people up. You see people going up in the air. That is how it's gonna be. You're gonna see the elect, a whole set of dark skinned people. All right, because at that said moment, 
all right now israel is all different shades you can have you know israelites that look like the so-called white man look like the so-called chinese all right so-called east indians all right but at that set hour while they're going up they're gonna change into that heavenly body which gonna be dark skin so all you're gonna be seeing is dark skin men women and children going up in these so-called ufos that is the rapture all right that is the rapture all eyes gonna see it all right all eyes gonna see the salvation of our lord yahaba shimmy shai this is first corinthians chapter 15 and verse 51 it says behold i show you a mystery we shall not all sleep but we shall all be changed so at that said moment they're gonna change it says in a moment in a twinkling of an eye at the last trump for the trumpet shall sound and the dead shall be raised incorruptible in the heavenly body and we shall and 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 we shall be changed it says for this corruption must put on incorruption and this mortal must put on incorruption um this, this slack this this corruption will put on incorruption and this mortal shall put on immortality immortality all right so at that said moment when they're going up they're gonna change from that earthly body into that heavenly body so you're gonna see people going up and wondering where is this event and then you're gonna realize hey this is the rapture it's not people just disappearing all over the world you're just gonna see people all over the world disappearing not disappear i'm going up into the chariots all right the so-called ufos that that is you up to this is what you're gonna see this is what you're gonna behold you're gonna behold that and that is the salvation of the elect all right of the negroes latinos and native americans which make up the house of israel this is revelation chapter 11 and 11 it says and after three days and a half the spirit from yahabah shimeo shai entered into them all right when we came out here and prophesied it says and they stood upon their feet and great fear fell upon them which saw them and they heard a great voice from heaven saying unto them come up hither this is the rapture come up hither and they ascended up to heaven in a cloud or in a chariot because originally the word cloud never meant a puff of smoke it literally means if you go into the etymology of the word cloud you will actually see it means a mountain a mountain so what mountainous object would be in the sky that these people were going up into you ever heard of a vimana in east indian culture they they they, they call them the vehicles of the lord vimanas look like a, a big mountain floating in the sky all right these big chariots gonna be in the sky all right and they are sending up into a mountainous um flying object a chariot a chariot of the most high you call them ufos and their enemies beheld them verse 12 i read over verse 12 it says and they heard a great voice from heaven said unto them come up hither and they ascended up to heaven in a cloud and their enemies beheld them so it's not gonna be no 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 secret event it's gonna be a worldwide event we're all gonna see the elect and the one third of israel going up into the chariots they're gonna see black men women and children going up into dark-skinned men women and children going up in these chariots all right so it's not gonna be some you know some event that you know people just gonna disappear now nah, that is not that don't don't forget where you see on tv that is hollywood you know um idea of the of the of the um the salvation of the lord that 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 is not how the salvation gonna be or the so-called rapture that's not how we're gonna be all right that's not how we're gonna be this is um isaiah chapter 40 and verse 5 it says and the glory of the lord shall be revealed and all flesh shall see it together for the mouth of Yahaba Shemia Shai had spoken it. All flesh gonna see. They're gonna see it together that the Lord coming to deliver the elect. All right. And as Paul said, we're gonna ascend up um and the dead shall rise incorruptible. All right. And in Thessalonians, he said we're gonna meet them in the clouds, meet them in the, the, the large mountainous vehicles, the chariots of the Lord. All right. You're gonna see all eyes gonna see the elect 
going up in the heavens all right all eyes gonna see that they're gonna behold that wondrous event all right the final precept here this is wisdom of solomon chapter 5 and verse 1 it says then shall the righteous man stand in great boldness before the face of such as have afflicted him and made and made no account of his labors when they see it they shall be troubled with terrible fear why because they're gonna see these chariots coming doing destruction and taking up these people and why why are they taking up these people and what are these 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 are aliens and oh, what, what happened people are gonna be bugged out but then they're gonna remember that we were out there we were out there on the forefront prophesying of these things they're gonna remember that that we were out there prophesying of these things all right it says when they see it they shall be troubled with terrible fear and shall be amazed amazed at the strangeness of his salvation They're like these men going up in the skies so far beyond all that they looked for and they repenting and groaning for anguish of spirit shall say within themselves this was he whom we had sometimes in derision and a proverb and reproach we fools this is said this is he this is he means they're gonna see the elect going up and they're gonna see this is he look 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 at these people who we counted as nothing and look they're going up into the chariot look the lord delivering them they're gonna see salvation they're gonna see the rapture they're gonna be a witness of it all right it says we fools accounted his life madness and his end to be without honor for he is how he how is he numbered among the children of Yahweh and his lot among the saints all right so they're gonna see the elect going up they're gonna behold the rapture they're gonna behold the salvation of the elect so it ain't gonna be no secret event so forget what the church teaching it all right as the scripture said all eyes shall see the salvation of the lord so with that i want to give all praises and all glory to yahaba shimei Shai. i want to give double honor to the apostles of great mercy that do rule well Salutations to the men of the Hoofland. Since the elect is a brother Makaza from the Trinidad camp saying Shalawam and stay strong. Shalawam.